Hello. We're going to do a short sequence now. Come in Sukhasana, easy seat, for calming the mind. Find your breath and quiet the mind. Place your hands on your body to feel your breath. Shoulders are back, lift your chest. Abdomen slightly engaged. And breathe. Calm, rest, and still your mind. Focus here on your chest. And focus on your breathing. Soften your face, your shoulders, arms, and body. Sit up tall with the spine straight. Crown of the head is up towards the sky. Take five breaths here. Breathe softly. Create a sleep smile. Slowly open your eyes. Let me do this practice if you are healthy. Ask your doctor before starting this practice. We will start with tabletop. Then we'll go to cow pose. Then cat pose. And then child pose. Table, cow, cat, and child. We will start on our hands and knees, tabletop. Shoulders are directly over the wrist. And your hips are directly over your knees. Breathe into your nose. Drop your belly, look forward. Exhale, belly up, round your back and chin to chest. Inhale. Cow. Exhale. To cat. Continue doing that on your own, finding a nice transition between the two postures. And start to include small movements that feel good. Back to table, bring your big toes together, knees apart, and sit back on your heels and rest. This is child pose, a resting pose. You can come here anytime. Settle down into the mat. Let go of all tension. Start to roll up slowly. Next pose will be downward facing dog. Now downward facing dog. Come to table pose. Walk hands forward. Push hips up, then back. Bend the knees to elongate the side body. Now 
Now straighten the legs. Bend your right knee, left is straight. Look under left armpit and feel the stretch along the side and breathe. Straighten your right leg and bend the left. Look under your right armpit and feel the stretch. Come back to center and bend both knees and then straighten your legs. Bring your left foot to center of the mat and extend your right leg and reach up long. Bend your knee if you'd like to. Bring right leg down and step up to the front of the mat between your hands to high lunge. Drop back knee and look forward and breathe. On an inhale, straighten your back leg to high lunge. On an exhale, lower your knee down to the mat to low lunge. Inhale, straighten. Exhale, lower your knee. Inhale, straighten your leg and step your right foot back to meet the left and push into downward facing dog. Come high on your toes, stretch, bend your knees, and then straighten your legs. Bring right foot to center of the mat and extend your left leg high in reach. Bend your knee here if you like, and just feel the stretch along the side body. And breathe. Mm -hmm. Lower the left leg and step your left foot to the front of the mat between your hand to high lunge. And breathe. Lower your back knee. And breathe. Inhale, straighten your back knee. And breathe. Exhaling, lower your back knee. Breathe. Straighten your leg and lower your knee down to the mat. Feel the stretches. Straighten your leg and step your left foot back to meet the other. And push yourself back into downward facing dog. Lower your knees down to the mat to table. Walk your hands forward a little bit. The hips stay put. Lower your elbows then your chest towards the mat. You can rest your forehead or your chin on the mat, whatever's comfortable for you. And breathe. On an inhale, come up. Walk elbows back to a line under your shoulders. Place hands on opposite elbows to check alignment. Push palms down, push up and back into a dolphin pose. Shift forward, lower down on an inhale. Exhale, push up and back. Inhale, lower, forward. Exhale, push up and back. Inhale, forward. Exhale back. This stretches the shoulders and makes them strong. Lower your knees to the mat. Come up onto your hands, straighten your arms, and push back into downward facing dog. And breathe. Shift forward to plank pose, squeezing all the muscles tight. 
Inhale here. Exhale, lower down into Chaturanga. Inhale to Upward Facing Dog. And then exhaling, roll over your toes and back into Downward Facing Dog. Breathing. Inhale, bring your right foot forward, right toes to the left hand, bend the knees and lower the leg down. Keeping the back leg straight, you're on the top of your foot and breathe. Make small adjustments, push up and lower down to pulsate. Pulse up and down. And then when you're ready, walk your hands forward, drop to the elbows, and breathe. This is an intense stretch to the hips. Inhale, straighten your back leg, and extend your right leg up. Inhale, curl, and knee the chin. Do this two more times, knee to the chin. Rounding the back as you bring the knee to your chin. And lower the leg. Push back into downward facing dog. On an inhale, shift forward into plank pose. Exhale, lower into chaturanga. Inhale to upward facing dog. Exhale into downward facing dog. Now prepare to do the other side with half pigeon, pulsating up and down. And breathe. Start to walk your hand forward, come down on your forearms, and breathe. Feel the hip flexor stretch. Inhale, push back. Inhale, extend up. Exhale, knee to chin. Inhale, extend your leg. Exhale, knee to chin. One more time. Inhale, extend. Exhale, knee to chin. And then lower the leg down to downward facing dog and breathe. Lower your knees down to the mat. Back to table. And do a couple rounds of cow cat transitions. Make it smooth and even. And then sit back in child pose and rest. And now we're going to do Malasana, squat pose. Pushing your elbows into inner knee. Extend your right arm under your right knee and left arm goes towards the sky. Push your right arm into the knee. And then switch sides. Left arm under your left knee and right arm up towards the sky. Lower your right arm and place both arms against the knees and push. Feel the stretch in the groins and the hips. And now we'll come down to Sukhasana again and extend over our legs. Start to sway side to side. And then walk over to your right side. Extend your left arm overhead and feel the stretch. Sway to the other side. And feel the stretch. 
reach your arm up to the sky. You sway back to the middle, swaying from side to side. And sway up to sit. Right hand off to the side, left leg extended. And then push up, bringing your hips up, extending your arm to the sky, and breathe. Lower down and prepare for the other side. Left hand down, right leg extends. And then lift your hip right up and extend right up to the sky. And stretch. Exhale, lower down. Come back to Sagasana and start to sway forward and back. And side to side. And then begin to roll your shoulders back, nice big circles, and then reverse, come forward, nice big circle. Arms up to a T, rotate your thumbs down and back, then rotate them up and back, down and back, up and back. Notice what it does for the shoulders. Lower your arm and do a gentle stretch to the neck. You can use your hand to help you encourage a slight stretch, but don't overdo it. Use your hand to push your head up. And then go ahead and do the other side. Use your hand to push your head back up. Bring your arms behind you, interlace your fingers, and straighten your arms. Lift them up a little bit, go as far as it feels good. Squeeze your shoulder blades together, and breathe. Release your hands and interlace your fingers the different way. It feels odd here. Straighten your arms and lift them up, and breathe. Release. And bring your arms out to a cactus. Squeeze your shoulder blades together. Right arm over left. I'm going to go to eagle arms. Squeeze the forearms together. Lift the elbows and feel the stretch. Rotate from side to side. Release and shake out your arms. Back to cactus, left over right. Into eagle arms. Squeeze your forearms and lift the elbows. Feel the stretch between your shoulder blades and rotate from side to side. Release and shake out your arms. Bring your right arm behind you. Use your left hand to push the elbow back to stretch your upper arm and breathe. Release and go to the other side. Encourage your elbow back behind you and feel the stretch in the front of your arm and breathe, release, shake out your arms. Your left leg goes down to the floor. You go wrap it around your body and the other leg crosses over. Right hand goes behind you, left hand can go on the outside of the knee or you can bring the elbow to the left side of the knee. This is a nice twist. Inhale to elongate your spine and twist to the right side, looking over your shoulder and breathe. Now switch legs. And twist to the left. Look over shoulder. Release and bow to the other side. Extend your legs and shake them out. Now we're going to lay down on our backs. We're going to bend our knees. We're going to do some rock and rolling on our back. Walk forward and back. 
in the whole spine. This is massaging the whole back. Roll up and squeeze your abdomen together. Keeping your knees bent, lower legs parallel to the floor. Squeeze your abdomen. Shoulders back. And then start to roll back and forth again a couple more times. We'll be doing two more of this variation of boat pose. And then start to roll forward and back to rock and roll. One more time. Inhale, squeeze the abs. Last boat pose, spread the toes, make it count. And rock and roll back and forth. Settle onto your back and extend your right leg up towards the ceiling. Interlace your fingers behind the right leg and extend your left. Flex both feet. And feel the stretch behind the leg. Bend the knee and change over to the other side. Bring both knees into chest and rock from side to side. Bring the knees to the armpits, spreading your knees. Grab on the soles of your feet towards your ceiling. A happy baby pose. Extend your legs and bring your body to rest. Extend your arms alongside your body with the palms up towards the ceiling. And relax. And breathe. You can stay in Savasana as long as you like. Bring in your knees to your chest, rock from side to side. Extend your left arm overhead and roll onto your left side. Use your left arm as a pillow. Use your right hand to help you come up to a seated position. And I come right back into Sukhasana. Place your hands any way you like. Let's begin Om. Inhale. Om. Inhale. Om. Inhale. Oh. Find your breath. Relax your hands and breathe. Bring your hands into prayer. Uh -huh. Bring the thumbs to the third eye. Bring the thumbs to the lips. And then bring your thumbs to the heart. And then bow to yourself to seal your practice. Peace, peace, peace. Namaste. Thank you. Peace, love, yoga.